I think I always wanted to be a swimmer, but it was more I wanted to go to the Olympics and I wanted to compete for my country and, and do that on the biggest stage. And, and I've been lucky enough to do that once and, and uh, hopefully next year I'll be able to do that again. You know, I have lots of memories. Um, there were times when I'd just be sitting at home in front of the telly, seeing people swim at the Olympics. And to be on the Dolphins team was definitely something I always wanted to, to be a part of. I guess my favourite memory would have been watching um, Ian Thorpe and Grant Hackett compete against each other and um, always battling it out in the pool. Grant Hackett's one of my, my biggest heroes and, and Justin Norris as well. And uh, you know, when you see those, that green and gold cap, or like gold cap I should say, um, racing internationally and at those big meets, it really wants to, it really inspires you to, to go and swim at those meets and, and to swim well and to, and to do your country proud. You know, you get to see what they achieve and um, it can all be done right here within the vicinity of, you know, 100 metres. You can learn to swim and become an Olympic champion at the same, you know, virtually the same place. You know, we're a bunch of individuals that are training every day to get the best out of themselves and, and doing that in a, in a, in a humble way and, and um, showing respect to others and, um, and to each other as well. Australia always sticks together and like having respect for each other and always like trying to get the best out of yourself. Yeah, be part of the Dolphins team, it'd be awesome to um, do it for 2015 and then hopefully for uh, 2016 Olympics. Well, I want to be on that Australian swim team and, and be called a Dolphin again. That's that's probably the biggest motivator to get everything right that I can I can be on that team and, and be labelled a dolphin once again. <laughs>